Well, a legendary songwriter has died, Kim Williams, who was known for writing hits for Garth Brooks, Kenny Chesney, and so many others, passed away while on vacation in Florida. New at 10, our Cuthbert Langley sat down with his writing partner tonight. Cuthbert, uh, Williams leaves behind quite a legacy. He does, Rory, not only for the songs he wrote, but also for the jokes he cracked as he, Kent Blasey, and Garth Brooks wrote some of the most well-known songs in country music. There are three wooden crosses on the right side of the highway. You recognize the song, but you may not recognize the man singing it. Your best to give them all a That's Kim Williams in April of last year singing the hit he wrote for Randy Travis. And these three guys together always had so much fun writing songs. You recognize only one person in this picture, Garth Brooks. But on either side are Williams and Kent Blasey three men who wrote some of the biggest country music hits. I would hope he'd be remembered for being the hardest working songwriter that I've ever seen. A workplace explosion that burned nearly 90% of Williams' body brought him here to Nashville in the 70s. He met Garth Brooks and helped to write Papa Loved Mama, one of the superstar's earliest hits. Down the sun then came Ain't Going Down Till the Sun Comes Up, a song all three wrote together in Blazy's studio that happened to have a cockroach problem. Kim said, I oh, don't worry about it. When Garth and I wrote Papa Love Mama, there were termites and cockroaches crawling all over my apartment, and it was a number one record, so this is going to be a number one record. He was right. But success never defined the songwriter. His attention to detail did. He was totally focused on writing songs. He did his homework. He was always out. He called it fishing for hooks. Despite the changing trends of Nashville, Williams still wrote for some of the biggest artists. The height of his career came in 2003 when he wrote Three Wooden Crosses, a song he knew would be successful. Heaven only knows. It was special to us and, and, and something that meant something to the world too. An unintended tribute to one of his most honest views of life. Not what you take when you leave this world behind you. What you leave behind you when you go. Kim Williams was 68 years old. Funeral arrangements have not yet been set. We reached out to Garth Brooks' publicist tonight, but have not heard back. We're live in the newsroom. Cuthbert Langley, News Channel 5.